Did the British government lie about protecting civilians in Iraq? The UK had previously claimed that they fought a perfect war against the Islamic State, which is a term I very much object to. There is no perfect war unless it's the war that was avoided, in my opinion. Newly published documents show from government reports that they knew that they had hit civilians and that there were attacks that could have been averted. Here is what a spokesperson for the Ministry of Defense said to The Guardian when they published this. They said there is no evidence or indication that civilian casualties were caused by strikes in Syria and Iraq. So. Are we to believe that the UK may have accidentally killed some civilians, but this is the extent of it? Or is this a report showing us just one piece of what is probably a much bigger puzzle? 